All right, everybody, it's um, currently over here in Texas, uh, 7.13 p.m., Sunday, June 26th. And welcome, everybody, to my uh, sixth episode of um, my vlog series. Um, a little bit of a delay again, but, you know, it's, you know, things come up, so, uh, you know, at least I've been able to do at least uh, do this, inst have this installment up, uh, you know, during the weekend uh, on this Sunday. Um, yeah, so might as well just get to it. Um, hopefully this entry will be a little bit more brief, considering I've got less to, you know, i got a little bit more focus uh, as far as what to cover. Um, I, during this past week, I had, um, worked my second gig, which is basically the follow-up to what I had already worked uh, late May. Uh, you know, with the same company, with the same group of people and everything like that. And it was just only uh, two days work over at the uh, American Airlines Center, uh, which was kind of cool. Um, two days work was more of a live, live gig, uh, more along the lines of what I was uh, we had uh, sort of uh, learned of in full sale and everything like that. And um, I, had a, I had a good time, though... As far as my um, ability to be on the ball, personally, I, I guess I guess person personally, I don't think I kicked as much ass as I should have as I could have. Um, yeah, that's um, you know looking back on it, I think I you know there's a lot more that I could have done, but. Um, but if, uh, but if I did make a great impression on those who, 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 with whom I worked with and everything like that, then uh, I don't know. I guess there's always room for improvement, but hopefully I didn't screw up too much this last time, if at all. But I, I'm per personal, I'm feeling like I did. But then again, that's just me wanting to just constantly improve. Um, made a lot of cool contacts there. Um, and I guess just a little bit more openings as far as just where I might find some more work. But uh, during those two days, you know, um, I guess I could say exactly what it was for. I don't, I don't want to risk too much. Um, I'll just go ahead and say it. I did work the, uh, I was working the uh, Dallas, um, the Dallas series of, uh, auditions for the X Factor for the first season of the X Factor um, here in the United States um, so I was a stand-in uh, at one point uh, very briefly on the first day of working uh, you know for the judges they had us uh, go sit in the judges seats I uh, happened to have uh, sat in the Simon seat the set looked awesome and it was it was a huge it was a cool gig it's just that I don't know um, I was left relatively idle and inactive, you know, and whenever I just stop moving and sit still, I get a little too comfortable and too lazy. Um, I don't know. Um, I just um, think I was on the ball as far as like jumping in to help whenever people needed help, but um, the little ADD of me, you know, kind of... Uh, kicked in whenever I just really couldn't stay focused on one simple sort of idle task and I just got a little carried away. I'm not, I, I don't know, that's personal how I felt. Um, something worth improving on, but hopefully I think I made a good impression, at least as a person, um, to those who, with whom I worked with and, um, and hopefully this, this didn't, 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 uh, this didn't hurt me, but, um, I did work another gig, so, uh, slowly kind of creeping back up um just now I actually came back from the gun range and guitar center uh just spent a few uh squeezed off several rounds at the range um but now this but the, today I, um i'm going to start uh, uh enrolling in the uh this uh, online uh, driver's ed class that i had uh decided uh, narrowed down 
the, the, the class that I narrowed down, which one, you know, the one that I'd be taking. And, um, yeah, I just get that not out of the way and so I can get uh, some actual movement. And it's like two, maybe three weeks, I think, since I had actually found out about this. So, like, you know, it's, you know, it's, it's something I've been putting off more than I really needed to, more than I should have, um, if at all. Um, but when, I guess once I get started, you know, I'll get a little bit more... Uh, a huge step forward as far as my ability to be, you know, to put myself out there and to start working again. Um, you know, kickstarting my own pre productive uh, energies. You know, I'm gonna, I'm getting back into the creative uh, flow of writing and uh, expanding my options as far as researching for that one World War II script. My friend, a uh, good friend of mine, um, had assisted me on uh, research. Uh, on research uh, options, and I've uh, just just today just come up with new op op options for me to try to go after. But there's just a bunch of personal projects that I could uh, go ahead and just start getting bu getting myself busy with. Um, this endless chore of uh, endless list of like personal chores and everything like that is probably just gonna in time. I think I'm gonna have to just get it done, but not. I can't stress myself out about getting everything done. I mean, just one step at a time, slowly but surely. I get into the swing of things and not jump in and really, you know, I guess it's like a start trying to get fit or start trying to bulk up to work out or whatever, you know, it's, you know, um, just lifestyle changes, nothing too big as then I'll be prone to giving up, you know, uh, early on in the process. But that's, uh, that's something, you know, I want to just kick my, kick start myself with. Um, I don't know if I mentioned it before, but I had a, uh, Ventured out to some of the local uh, areas around here just to pick, you know, just like a temporary job for me to pick up. And um, there's a few more, a few options um, for me to take op take advantage of, you know, somewhere close enough to where that I can, you know, have a ride provided for me um, while I just make some sort of uh, you know, work on some sort of income while I work on some other side projects and. Uh, yeah, uh, it's just, you know, me getting up every day at midday, it's not really doing doing me any good, nor is it, you know, you know, I just got to work on my self-discipline like I had in uh, Full Sail, but, um, yeah, but, uh, you know, I met a lot more cool people and um, have, uh, you know, narrowed down just like my openings and the, the networks that I've been getting into, just uh, stuff narrowed it down to stuff that's uh, pertaining to uh, work I may find in Texas and um, sometime this year I'm still thinking about going to Austin to, you know depending on what kind of work I may find here out there or I could just stay here either way um, you know it's got to keep the ball rolling and keep going faster um, but yeah it's just I gotta build, build up a schedule as far as um, as far as what I got to be doing, you know, as far as what uh, how my week is going to be uh, planned out, and how to separate the uh, personal time to with work time, and um, have both be going pretty well before I can even attempt to marry up the two. But um, so yeah, the uh, basic. Uh, flow of things for me so far is that uh, yeah I worked another gig so I should be seeing another check so come in sometime um, obviously not going to be as much money but you know still going to be money you know and um, start building up the discipline of uh, spending and everything like that and I can you know get some attention uh, sent to uh, you know budgeting and you know, getting you know, make sure that I'll be still be able to pay off my loans and whatnot. So, um, running up to ten minutes. Uh, I guess I guess that's it for this week. Um, you know, work the work the X Factor thing up in Dallas, and that was a lot of fun. And I really hope, uh, and I think it's something I'll be I'll make a return for uh, next time around. And um, by then I'll be loads more uh, efficient and 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 kick ass. But um, I'm still relatively green, and hopefully I'm not screwing too many things up, or just find myself in a niche, find find myself in a niche quick before you know, 
I risk uh, ruining my reputation doing something I'm not too qualified for, but just doing something that, uh, you know, uh, I feel like I need to just for work. If I make myself get into something, uh, you know, it's an, something I'm very comfortable and really active with and happy with, then uh, I think I'll be good. Um, other than that, I'm still looking for more creative, uh, some creative ideas for the, uh, for a title for my vlog series. Um, I don't know if just enough, not enough people are watching or just, uh, what, but if you, uh, if I end up picking your suggestion, then I'll personally give you a shout out on, uh, and, you know, on a future installment of, of these vlogs and, and, um, yeah, it's, it's about as much of a, a reward as I can give. So anyways, yeah, if you stuck around this long again, thank you for, uh, thank you for watching, and, um, if you're a peer of mine, if you were a classmate of mine, who was, uh, just doing some work, you know, if you want to just catch up with me, feel free to just message me, um, you know, I'll be, I'm definitely interested in what you, what you got going on, and, uh, if you've got any suggestions or offers or anything like that, please feel free to just, you know, hit me up. Um, and for any of you guys in the North Texas, the Dallas-Fort Worth area, who's, you know, working in the same field as I am and could, you know, have some sort of advice to offer me or whatever, please, please feel free to uh, send any information my way. Um, I guess that's about it. Um, running up to the 12-minute mark, I guess that's the norm now. Um, that's it. Yeah, I'm going to start my driver's ed. I'm going to do my, uh, keep doing my thing. Um, that's about it, really. Uh, thanks for sticking around, and I'll see you next week. See ya.